Hi, my name is Keston Williams and I'm Technical Director at Barfoots of Botley. We supply a number of different vegetable products, one of which is sweet corn. Initially, we thought of the sweet corn husks as waste, but now we see them as fuel. This short film describes how we've turned a real problem into a renewable energy solution using one of these. Sweet corn is produced on our site near Chichester all year round. Raw material is supplied by our growers in UK, Germany, Spain and Senegal. During the production process, we strip off the husk from around the sweet corn and trim the top and bottom. Any defective cobs are also removed at this point too. This waste is removed from the building and gets crushed to remove as much of the water as possible. This green waste is then stored in a silage clamp until it is ready to be used in the biodigester. Essentially, the anaerobic digester is one big cow. In goes green waste in one end. This then gets broken down by microorganisms in the digesters and comes out as gas, solids and liquids. The gas is used to power these generators which produce 2.3 megawatts of power per hour. This is enough to power all our needs in the factory and 3,000 homes. The other output is digestate. This is in the form of liquid and solids. The solids can be spread on the fields and used as soil conditioner, whereas the liquid can be used to supplement the fertilizer and irrigation requirements. We capture the heat from the engines that power the generators through a heat exchanger and use it to keep the biodigesters at their optimum temperature. We also use the heat to power this piece of equipment that pasteurizes the liquid digestate, killing any harmful unwanted bugs. This has been a massive investment for us of over five million pounds and has opened up a range of opportunities for the business. We are currently developing a new site that will digest commercial and industrial waste. We have an opportunity to look at vehicles such as forklift trucks, company cars and vans converting them to electricity. Hopefully, I'll be able to share some of these initiatives with you in the future.